We've had a chilled one this morning. Well, I've done some tent keeping. And uh, now, because people have vacated this little secret hideaway camping spot, we come up this little staircase next to our spot and nabbed it for a, a fun, different dining experience. <laughs> It has been raining all afternoon, which has been nice and refreshing because it's been so hot. So we've just been chilling out in the tent, reading. Hilary and Adam have gone off into town and we're going off into town as well. I might meet up with them later. Jeans, shoot, weather. And a coat if it rains, carrying on raining. Everything looks so different after it's been raining. Doesn't it? Yeah, it's me. <laughs> yeah, he's dressed completely differently. Instead of being in shorts and a t-shirt. Yeah, it feels lovely, lovely and refreshing. I was getting so hot. <laughs> Deserted. So quiet. Found a nice little restaurant. Especially for a rainy day. This is our first sangria of the holidays. I've got a pink flower. <laughs> Don't try then. <laughs> Our starter has arrived with the famous Collier anchovies. Now our second course has arrived. I'm having sardines and that looks like mashed sweet potato. Don't know, I'll have to try it. Uh, ben has got some kind of... A fillet fish, white fish. White fish. And a very nice, I like these things they make. Oh, it's like Spanish omelette. Mmm, like, yummy. heading back now because everything was cancelled <laughs> but it's been a lovely evening anyway and the sky is looking amazing <laughs> Where you bought your flippers. Is it? Yeah. This is pretty. Oh, this is where you do the train change. I think so, yeah. We have 
just had a lovely picnic, but I didn't vlog it because I'm not that good at just getting absolutely every detail of our day on vlog. But it was delicious, cheese and wine and bread, and we are in the Spanish town of Jalasa. And Ben's just about to go and see when the fishing boat's coming in. And then there's a fish auction marketplace as well. Yeah. You might see some big fishes. And we're going to head for the beach. Yes. And it's very hot, so yeah, it puts up the parasol. It's very windy. <laughs> Here we are at the fishing port. We're thinking maybe because it's Monday and yesterday was Sunday that there hasn't really been any fishing going on but this is the auction area we've been in before and there's some small boats here and usually you see them coming in with their catch and sorting it and unloading it it's a very hot day bigger and a kind of a new addition I think since we last came. Another big fishing boat. I don't know how to tell the difference between trawlers and drifters when it comes to looking at a boat. So whether they're drift nets or trawl nets, they're massive and they're all rolled up at the moment. is this sort of thing, pescatourisme, taking people on fishing excursions as tourists. It'd be fun. All these refrigerated vans have arrived to come in, pick up the catch. And this is the auction area. Getting all the ice and trays out. Just winding in the last of the net. Oh, there's a couple of little fish there. That's just tea. No, we didn't get over it quick enough, did we? Oh, we've missed the fish. Yeah, we didn't run round the port in time. So there's a bit of auctioning going on over there, and all the people that have driven down in their refrigerated vans bidding. Squid or octopus. They've all got like little electronic things that they press. The thing what's happening now is that the bidding's ended and now they're phoning back to their restaurants to say what they can cook for dinner tonight.
the back lights. Back lights didn't work. The same, the left one's dimmer. And he's driving really close. And he's close to the driving close. And any other distinguishing marks? Well, there's a bit of an accident in the middle of the road. Oh, yeah. 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 Dogs are hoovering up whatever we drop. 